this is merchant accounts, cash apps, PayPal, anything like that. Traditionally, what we're reporting on is the gross amount, the amount before any fees come out. So let's say you do a transaction. It's $100 and there's $5 in fees. You get 95. How do we report that on the bookkeeping file? We're going to report sales of $100. We're going to report merchant account fees or you know, something of that nature for $5. And that's where we're going to match it to the 95. The problem is if we only report the 95, these providers are going to send 1099s. And their 1099s are going to show that $100. And so when you go to file your tax return, the IRS is going to get a 1099 that says you had $100 in sales, but you're only showing 95. And the IRS is going to say, oh, you owe us some taxes because you're missing $5 in there. 